lovelies welcome back to my channel today i am going to do a review on these lipsticks these lipsticks are from itex dazzler so i have in two shades i'm just gonna share my thoughts and opinion about these lipsticks so to know more about this then please keep on watching many of you all know about this brand already so if you haven't heard about this brand before then this is very affordable brand and you can also find very easily on these local stores yes um, they have recently launched their matte lipsticks i guess i am not sure when they have launched this but i used to have one dazzle long bag it's like used to be very you know shimmery satiny which i was not very huge fan of but i heard that they have launched their matte lipsticks I was very excited to know that the brand like itex has launched their matte lipsticks i was very interested to, to try it on these retails for like 132 rupees which is so affordable so again a good point of that so let's just comes about the packaging this is the packaging of the lipsticks looks like it's like a goldenish brown packaging very bulky it's very bulky so they are not very travel friendly the packaging because this one shuts okay but this one can you see this doesn't shut properly at all it's very wobbly so they are not very travel friendly in packaging wise and they are not color coded which again i hate this because um you cannot find your shade whatever the shade that you want you cannot just find it out through the packaging and they are not color coded in the bottom as well they have their numbers this is matte 138 and what this is matte 174 so they have m that means matte but if you go to stores they might have that tester packaging so that you can find what shade that you want that's how i chose this and when you open it regular bullet you get the pack uh, you get the lipsticks here and uh, they contains four gram of lipsticks which is good and this is in the shade 138 this is how it looks like this is what i have it on my lips and this is m174 it's a very pretty brownish mauvish nude shade i like it a lot so now coming about a lipstick texture so they have like huge variety of color ranges which i'm really happy about to say they claim to be matte yes they are matte no not a doubt in that and i would also say they are not at all moisturizing so they are very matte they are not creamy matte they are not so i i will always recommend to moisturize the lips very nicely or just remove your uh, if you have dry lips scrub it once apply moisturizer then wait blot it then apply these lipsticks they are very matte and but they do transfer that's the beauty of it they do transfer don't expect it to be transfer proof completely they do transfer um they have very faint smell waxy smell kind of they're not very sweet they don't they smell very chemically very waxy but it's very faint and it's not overpowering when you apply it on the lips they don't even bother you so, uh, tell you the texture is very matte but it's kind of very waxy you can feel it you know just watch the shade that i have this is 130 this is what i have it on my lips so this is just a one swipe they are very pigmented but you can see it is not completely covering it's not very opaque they are pigmented with very they are not very opaque you know what i mean you can see in one swipe you can see the color but they're not very opaque they don't cover your uh, pigmentation or something if you have pigmentation i have it here they do enhance they do show the pigmentation of your lips so keep that in mind because of the taxi texture so yeah this is second swatch the color is very pretty but the texture is not my favorite this is the next shade this is 174 this is my favorite shade uh yeah just gonna swatch it here you know what i mean i am giving a good pressure i'm not like slightly doing i'm not giving complete pressure i'm just giving a good pressure to keep it swatch can you see it's not coming because of the waxy texture they, that the lipstick has it's just because of that it's not completely opaque so second swatch third swatch the colors are super pretty it's a perfect uh, nude shade that i would say and i don't love the texture of this lipstick but still i love the color so whenever i feel uh, i just want to wear lipstick but i'm confused about the color 
I go for that one even the texture is not my favorite you know so you have to keep on reapplying this lipstick even if you have a coffee or drinks or foods you know you have to reapply because they do transfer as I said before and they do make your lips drier so have a lip balm with you for that moisture I think the reapplication process if you have very dry lips it will not be a best friend because it will settle on fine lines and it will enhance the dry patches Keep that in mind as well so when you are trying to reapply have a lip balm blot it then reapply it that would be the best thing to do yeah and i don't have uh, anything else to say about these lipsticks these are my very honest review uh, opinion i hope you all like this video and if you find this video to be useful give this video a big thumbs up and do subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and do follow me on my social media as links are in the description box i will see you all soon in my next video till then take care bye